AFTV, we just finished watching the uh, friendly um, Arsenal one, Nuremberg one. What did we learn from that? I don't think the manager's good enough, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> it is what it is, isn't it? It is what it is. It's preseason, first game. When the lineup came out, I was quite excited. I thought, strong lineup, put a few goals past them. We'll see how some Balogun come on and, and we'll see what they're all about. It didn't work out like that. Um, I was playing a close eye on Eddie first half, some of the second, and then Balogun. That didn't work out the way I'd hoped with Balogun missing basically two open goals. Um, so there's still question marks about who's going to be the. The one, I believe, to, to continue into next season. And, you know, it's just one of those ones. Excited to see them back. Underwhelmed with the performance and the result. But it's the first game of pre-season, so I can, we, we can let it slide. Yeah, I mean, it was a bad error by the goalkeeper that got Nuremberg back in the game. Because before that, also kind of controlling it, we were kind of was almost saying it's too easy for them. Yeah, and that, was, that wasn't his only mistake in the second half. He nearly mm. cost us again. Um, look at the way, the way we conceded. We should never, never have conceded that goal. But we should have been creating more chances and scoring more ourselves. I think the first half, we controlled. We dominated possession. But we failed to really create clear-cut chances. Beautiful goal by Saka. So, um, mm. big up him because we saw that multiple times last season. If he can you know, continue that, then more goals, more assists next season. Um, you know, bright future, as we all know. Aside from that, in the first half, I was, again, underwhelmed. Second half, we got a chance to see Havertz, or did we? That, that's the mm. question I'm asking now, because he was ghost. Um, he didn't really get on the ball. But one thing I, I, I'll say in his favour is it just seemed like players were getting a run out in the second half. When Havertz mm. was in the A, Eddie was on, in, on the left, Balogun was on the right, and Jesus was up top. Two players in positions that they're not too familiar with in Eddie on the left and Balogun on the right. So it wasn't... The best second mm. half, but there's reasons why behind that. And yeah, back to Balogun. I just wish he just banged in one of them and, and we could have, you know, been talking him up a bit more following the game. Yep. Yeah, um, one player did play well, Enwin the, the the youngster who came on, he was one of the shining lights though. He was. He was. Uh, at least said then, I'm sure he was saying his fan cam, but that's what you want to see when you, when you get a chance to see a player that... He's not necessarily on the cusp of the first team, but he's out to prove himself. And I think the same for a, a Havertz. I think the same for a Balogun. I think the same for a lot of players that, that played today. Eddie as well. But Nwaneri came on and he just looked hungry. He looked like he wanted the ball. Um, when he got the ball, he has very good feet. There was a moment or two there where he showed some beautiful skill in the middle. Um, good runner on the ball. And his passing was decent as well. So mm. at 16... That could be a big player for us in, in the future. Definitely, definitely. So, marks out of 10 for the first friendly. <laughs> oh, first friendly, marks out of 10, 5. Shop for AFTV merch at shop.aftv.co.uk. Subscribe to us on YouTube. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat and Twitch. We've got content for every platform, so check it out.